All right, we are here with Marta with the new Latinas tech startup, and what is it called? It's called Made Boss, Made by Own Self, and it's an, an actual platform for low entry, low wage workers, entry level workers, in identifying where they could be in their careers, and we give them a plan on how to get there. So you know when your boss doesn't really see you, and you end up leaving because you can get paid somewhere else, but there's so much opportunity in your organization, Made Boss actually shows you, and then shows the potential that you have to come company executives so that they can invest in you so you can grow from within. Wow, and when did you launch this beautiful <laughs> Latino <laughs> platform. empowerment platform? So it really is for anyone, but it so happens that for the most part, people working in low-wage jobs happen to be Latinos. Um, I've been in talent acquisition, talent management, you know, in companies, the people that lead, the recruiters that are reviewing resumes, that was my job. That's I how was, you started this. Yeah, I was the boss of those people, right? And so, in my uh, background, like I've interviewed people all the way from janitors to vice presidents, and one of the things that I've learned is that the reason people are not getting the job is because they don't know what it takes to get there. And a lot of the times, Latinos, we deselect ourselves from yes, that we job. We're like, oh, I don't have that. I can't do that. I've never done it. So never mind. And then you move on to something else. But with Made Boss, yes. essentially we say, but you can. And here's how you can do that. So my background has been in that. And I saved up so I can leave my actual executive career and come and launch Made Boss. Wow, and so now you are empowering Latinos all over the country. Um, what is the, I heard some exciting news about Made Boss, yeah. tell us about it. so for the first time we got, so we run a campaign and we invited the community to invest in us. We raised a little bit under 120,000 just from Latino, majority wow. Latina investors. Latina. This is through an equity crowdfund. That led us to build what is called the minimum valuable product, which means yes. the actual you know product that people can start using. Exactly. And then from there, we got our first venture capital firm to invest, the Yama Camel Camelback Ventures, and they're based out of New Orleans. So we're one of uh, one of their cohort invested companies, Good. and they're our first VC to invest in us. Wow. And so, what does that mean in layman's term? And when can we see change, new changes happening? Awesome. So what it means is that. If you look at the big spectrum of things, there are less than 1% Latinas that receive investment. I'm one of those. And when we invested from, we went to the community, um, the only 3% of companies get selected to be a part of the platform, and we were one of them. So we're already, we're not even there, and we're already like this tiny little unicorn. And I just want to thank all of you for believing in us and knowing that at the end of the day, we make it, you make it. Like we're all in this together. It requires to be bold and really focused and to be brave. And we have all of that in our community. All right, and so how can the Latino community access your platform and get better jobs and, and get a better life? So right now we're only B2B, which means that we sell it to, to actual companies. So if you're at a company, you're in HR, or you know that the company is looking for something to support people from going from within, you call us, Made Boss. Um, but essentially, once we have that platform ready to go, then we're going to open it up so you can download the app and be able to see where you could be in your career and unlock your potential. Congratulations. Thank you. Another strong Latina in the Bay Area. Woohoo! Yes. Oh, even better. Oh, claro, de Michoacán. Órale, pues.